toys collected for the Marines and their Toys for Tots campaign. The toy corner in our studio is getting crowded. You can't even see half of what has been coming in here. The Low Country's chief meteorologist <laughs> live for us again this morning. Day two of the Toys for Tots Blitz, this time at the McDonald's on James Island. Rob, it's amazing to look over here on the, the other side of the studio. Maybe at some point we can get a shot of it. But the amount of toys that have come in in just the last couple of days is staggering. You're right, Brad, and uh, no surprise, our community is always so very generous, especially this time of the year for Toys for Tots. But we're live here at the James Island McDonald's on Folly Road. We're going to be here through the midday show through noon, so we encourage you to come on out and drop off your new unwrapped toy. If you do, McDonald's is going to reward you with a free all-day breakfast item. Got a couple of cool things going on. One of those, I'm going to bring in Trooper Matt Southern from the Highway Patrol. And Trooper Matt, you've got a, a cool bear there, but you also brought your cruiser. We want to do something. We want to stuff your cruiser with toys how about that that's right it's empty we need some toys to put in it so like you said we'll be here until about the noon hour bring as many toys as you can we want to put as many toys in here to you know help make Christmas special for children across the low country I know it's not the best of weather out here but come on out and brave the elements and come see us and let's let's pack your cruiser I think that'd be pretty cool there we go yes sir stuff it full of toys all right, let's bring in Staff Sergeant Justin Golden. He's our coordinator, and boy, we're winding things down. Uh, this is our last live broadcast for Toys for Tots, and you guys have a big day today and a big day tomorrow as well. Right. Uh, yesterday was our busiest day all season uh, as far as distributing the toys. We helped thousands of people yesterday. We still have a few more to go, so, um, you know, we're encouraging the community to come together for a last-minute push for toys. Uh, we still need toys for the older kids. Uh, if you see me later today, it's probably going to be at Toys R Us buying toys for the nine to 12 year olds but yeah we're, we got a uh, busy couple days ahead of us okay thanks staff sergeant we'll talk to you more coming up in just a few minutes but we're live here at mcdonald's come by and say hello and let's stuff the cruiser let's fill it up and fill up the mcdonald's as well josh i think we're sending it back to you can you do something about this weather I